Good morning, YouTube. I look like such a bum right now. I'm used to it because I don't think I'm putting on makeup for like at least two or three days. You know what's so funny? My teeth seem really white on camera, but in person, to me, it don't look. It does. It never looks as white on camera. I think like the light just reflects it a lot. Like someone asked me, they were like, "Damn." <laughs> This has to be the funniest comment I've heard. They were like, damn, your teeth are really bright. What toothpaste do you use? <laughs> As you guys know, I went to my dentist to fix my teeth. I, I was literally going to for a checkup and they're like uh, cleaning my teeth. And they were like, yeah, good to go. And like literally I went to go eat. I went to go eat some chicharron. First off, no one told you chicharron in Colombia was that damn hard. First off, what's going to some chicharron with some guacamole? And I beat it, and that tooth got chipped. I was like, wow. Well, at least I'm right next to him. I'm just gonna sit here until I have no more energy to sit here, and I'm forced to do schoolwork. I usually have to force myself into it, it never comes naturally. I'm never like, oh. This is such a pretty place. Let me just sit down and and do like six hours of reading and, and homework. No, bitch. I have to force myself to do it. So I'm here at this restaurant. I still got my headphone in. I do that a lot. I'm here at this restaurant. I took a shower, finally. Did a little bit of work. And look at my lunch. I have rice, sopa de costilla, aguacate, maracuya. I love it. And like food always be so cheap here in Colombia. Like I could literally have such a great fucking meal. A great bomb, bomb meal for a freaking king. For like five dollars. Four dollars. Love it. Why can't the United States be like this? Like look look how good that looks. I don't know if I can see that properly. But it's bomb. Like, I've been looking forward to this all day, so I'm gonna eat right now. And then I don't know what else I'm gonna do. I was probably gonna like make a reel, but look at me. I'm not, I'm not doing nothing today. because they're really intense. They are not nothing to play with. These classes, these freaking Colombians, they don't play around with salsa, okay? I've had a couple of beers, maybe you can tell. But, let's go. Hola 
Alexis. So I'm just gonna drink a little bit later. I'm gonna change. Actually, this is my third outfit change today. Second outfit change. And we're gonna go to the club. The Colombians will tell you be careful yeah. about the Colombians because the shit that goes on here is not normal. In Brazil. Two guys hit on me. One was married, oh, I and the other one was with a girlfriend, and a girl and a, a boy from his ex girlfriend. Oh my gosh, I'm literally talking on this vlog right now. So embarrassed. Like, embarrassed. I literally got everyone to come out last night. Everyone, like, even the hotel staff, because everyone, everyone that I was really had like, having fun with is leaving the hotel tomorrow. <laughs> So, everyone was going out. Everyone. Even the hotel staff, like, everyone. And I, I was convincing people to go out. I was like, come on, go out. Don't be lame. Don't be lame. <sighs> Dude, I don't even know what happened. I don't know what happened. One minute I was talking to somebody. The next moment, I woke up in my bed. And I'm like, what the hell? Because <clears throat> I had my hair done, I had makeup done, I had my outfit on. I'm like, why didn't no one wake me up? I had a good ass sleep though. Like, that sleep was bomb. One of the best. Because, you know, you don't get, like, the best sleep in a hotel. Like, after you've been there for a while, I've been here for a while. Like, to the point, niggas are asking, like, when are you going to leave? <laughs> You don't consistently get good nights, good night sleeps in hotels. It's almost like a weekend and done. You ever just be disappointed in yourself? Like, oh my God. I have to see, like, I have to see if they're willing to do it again and they're gonna go out one last time. And then I'll push my flight, I'll push my flight back to tomorrow. But if no one's willing to go out to I'll, I'm just gonna leave at six. I'm gonna eat lunch at that restaurant again. Because, damn, that shit was bomb. Bomb and poor dogs. Bomb. You can't beat it, can't beat it, can't beat it. I don't know what else I'm gonna do. Maybe go downtown, make it some clothes and stuff really quick. And then, yeah, but like I said, I have to see it first what everyone's on. <laughs> No, yo tengo una teoría que es bien, bien fuerte de aquí en Colombia. Ellos les gusta poner agua adentro de los bebidas. Eh, no, en serio. ¿Tú eres tomando? Mm -hmm. me, to me tomé tres shots de, de, de ron. Oh, no. Y tres cervezas. Ay, no. Es un mix bien loco. ¿Sabes qué? Me quedo dormido. ¿Tú no fuiste a bailar? No, me quedo dormido. Era por accidente. Pero tú estabas bien ya, mi amor. No sé qué pasa, de verdad. Un momento yo era hablando uh -huh. y el otro momento me despierto en la cama. Ah. Pero yo necesito una otra oportunidad con ustedes para salir. ¿Hoy? Hoy, sí. Hoy, hoy es el día. El día para... Right now I'm going to the super. 
I'm um, walking down the streets. I still have my night top on, my pajamas. But um, I'm going to the super to get bread. You know what's something they don't be having in Colombia? They don't have normal drinks. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but the juices, all this juice is, is made here in Colombia. They don't have no Jumex, and I like to drink Jumex in the morning. They don't have none of that. All this is from here. I truly can't eat and um, they feed me so yeah man every day I eat huge ass meals for like four dollars I gotta get out of here I really do I, I think I'm getting fat this is this is the reason I have to leave I can't keep eating this good I really can't actually go nowhere like my life ain't moving like that what i be doing working going to school i was here cleaning my house and washing clothes and stuff but today i gotta go do some stuff usually when i go to like meetings and things like that i usually wear like sweats but i have conservative business partners and they are like stop wearing sweats to meetings so I gotta go meet with this guy about an apartment I could possibly take from him. Gotta go pick up some mail. Follow me. Uber waiting outside. Like I said, right now, all the winners. Getting into my Uber, gonna go pick up some stuff from this dude's house. I have somebody who ships uh, things into Panama for me, so like everything that I buy online. There's not actually a post office here, right? There's not a post office here in Panama to be like, oh, I got something, let me just go to the post office and pick it up for free. No, 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 no. There is no free mail here. Or at least to my knowledge, if y'all know, let me know. Drop a link, send an address, something. But yeah, you usually have to go through private companies. So one of the most biggest companies here is Mailbox. And they're hella expensive. Like, the prices are not sustainable for nobody. That's why it's kind of like, if you have money, you get mail. If you don't have money, you don't get mail. Let's look at my big ass box. <laughs> Yo, thank God for these grocery carts. Cause I don't know how else I would get shit up there. I don't know how I get into the situation. She's off. See what I got. She's off. Look at my new chair, guys. Whoa. Room tour coming soon. Dude, I'm trying to go to Russia, right? I met this fine ass Russian, but he wasn't my type, but he was still fine. Did that ever, ever happen to you? Like, you meet a guy that wasn't your type? Like, emotionally? But you're like, still fine. Okay, I wanna go to Russia. Do you know how hard it is for an American to get into Russia? 
Look at my lights. I'm so happy to finally have lights again so I can record like a baddie instead of a broke bitch. Let's get with the program, little baby. Break it. You know that one Instagram reel? It's like, break it, break it. No, it's fine, break it. <laughs> That's right. I love it. I love it. I've been waiting for this to come for so long. I've literally been waiting for this to come for so long. I needed it. Like at this point, it is a actual need on my Instagram. Can I live without it? And I got two. I think I know what this is. Something. Love me some narcos. The series. Literally love me. Oh, look at my bath mat. Please don't do coke in the bathroom. Isn't that so cute? Look what finally decided to arrive. This was supposed to be my Valentine's Day dress. Like, I was supposed to wear this shit on Valentine's Day. Got a doormat. Cause I was like, I don't want no lame ass doormat. Like I want my house to be a reflection of me. Bitch, don't wear no shoes in the house. Cause I am dead serious. Read, read it very clear. Dead serious. Mhm. Mm so this is one of the outfits. I don't think you can see my nipples through this. Still gonna wear nipple covers. Still wear nipple covers. Okay, twelve dollars AliExpress. Took almost a day I'm about to get here, but we here. Okay, okay. I like that. I like that. All right, you had to cut that little try-on session short. Now I'm on the way to one of my apartments to. Uh, well, basically, I had to fumigate it. It had termites. So now I have to go back to the apartment and make sure there's no termites, one, get it prepped for tomorrow, two. So I'm here at the store. I gotta buy bed sheets. I already got this little toilet plunger. I needed one. Cause for some reason I got all these damn bathrooms in my house. But I don't I don't have not one single one of these. Oh look at this $5.99, $5.99 of oh, my alley baby. Another fitted sheet. Queen. Look at that. Out this store. Yup. Good to go. 